Hey YouTubers, it's me, Mustin07, coming at you once again through the power of OBS Recording Studios. And in this video, we're going to be going over how to generate power with the windmill in immersive engineering. As you can see, I'm in the same world as what I use for immersive routing, because I have both of those mods, because they go together pretty well. And you kind of have to have immersive engineering to have the full experience of immersive routing. But uh, let's, let's just get moving. We have the book and the lever, which we craft together to create this thing, the engineer's manual, which, you know, it has all sorts of cool stuff in it, like how to make all these cool things in immersive engineering. That's what it's for. So, moving on. Next we have the hemp plant, which is used for creating hemp fibers which are used in many things in immersive engineering including making the sails for the windmill so what the way you harvest it is just like any other crop in minecraft you just left click it and then you get industrial hemp seeds which you can plant back as you can see and then you can bone meal them as well you don't have to but uh, you can so moving on we next have the industrial hemp fiber and sticks which are used to create tough fabric which is used in the construction of the windmill sail and this is how you craft it. You can use a regular crafting table if you want as well but I was just using the engineer's crafting table. So with this tough fabric we're going to want to craft windmill sails. As you can see this is how you do it then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to use these windmill sails along with the windmill blade which is crafted like so so we're just going over here and then to make the windmill you use eight windmill blade pieces surrounding an iron ingot so then you take this and then you place it down and it's hooked up to all this and it starts spinning then what you want to do is you want to add the windmill sails which makes it spin faster and generates more power and this will start and this will go into here which will feed this capacitor which stores flux which is energy in immersive engineering now to measure the energy you take the engineers voltmeter which is crafted like this and then you right click it and as you can see, it has this much energy out of 1 million flux, which is the max it can store. Now, I am going to go over all these different parts in a future video, but when you get into all this stuff right here, it can be quite complex and technical. So it deserves its own video. However, to craft this medium voltage capacitor, you need these items in this arrangement and then you get the MV or medium voltage capacitor like so. That being said however I would say that that is pretty much the end of this relatively short video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more videos and goodbye.